Two days before the wedding, the dress came apart on me. It was made two sizes too small. Laura said I'd put on weight and refused to return my money. I told her I was having heart surgery next week. My chances were 50-50. When Chuck found out, he promised to make my dream come true. And I made a wish. I wouldn't die if I got married in a white dress. Laura brought another dress. She said it would fit. But the corset was too small. I screamed, stop! But Laura kept pulling and I got stuck. She grabbed scissors to cut me out. She said it was the only way. But then she billed me for it. Laura said I'd cut it up on purpose. I refused to pay, but Laura locked me in her boutique. She called the cops and demanded payment. I didn't want to cause trouble. I gave her everything and realized Laura was a con artist. She'd offered a discount to lure me in and rip me off. She confessed she'd always hated me and wanted to ruin my wedding. Laura didn't say more. She just pushed me out. I had no clue what I'd done to her, but Laura didn't stop there. She uploaded a video of me stuck in the corset and made me a laughing stock. Someone like her shouldn't get married. Did she eat her fiance? Get that fatso on a diet. I got worse. The doctor said my chances of survival had dropped to 20%. I called off the wedding. I didn't want to make Chuck a widower. I was being prepped for my heart surgery. When it nearly left out, Chuck brought me the prettiest dress ever. I saw it and fainted. It was a miracle I survived. Perhaps it was because of the dress. But my first visitor wasn't Chuck. It was Laura. She begged me to forgive her and told me why she'd done it. 11 years ago, Laura's daughter and I both needed a heart transplant. I got a heart. Lizzie died waiting for the next one. So Laura hated me in her boutique. She recognized me and decided to ruin my wedding. But Chuck changed everything. Turned out he'd made a video for the haters and told my story. That our wedding could be our family's only milestone. Guilt-ridden, Laura sent Chuck her best dress. I promised Chuck to recover and marry him. I forgave Laura and invited her to the wedding, and she hired me as her assistant. Now, her boutique offers wedding dresses of all sizes. The size of your waist doesn't matter. The size of your heart does. Agreed?